I've never been quite so embarrassed for politicians, even though I was standing on the stand with all the major parties. Uh, you know, all the governments have let these fishermen down. There was one fisherman that couldn't afford a crow, crew and his boat has sunk twice and he nearly died twice. You know, this is the situation. They can have to go out alone because they couldn't afford to pay anyone to help them. Um, it's... It's an outrage what's going on in the fishing. They're throwing fish back. There's a group of people that rightly so are at, should be angry politicians and bureaucracy. And, you know, and there there were all the other parties sitting there asking them for their vote, telling them that if you vote for them, they will sort it out, even though they've done nothing for years. And even a year ago, they got um, a slice of the pie and our government hasn't implemented it. Um, so we are on a 25 stop epic election tour with a tiny uh, little yellow catamaran fishing boat called the Rising Tide and we're stopping in 25 different local fishing communities to try and put pressure on MPs and candidates before the election to support their local fishermen and put local fishermen first. Are you in support of local fishermen rather than big factory ships? So a huge part of our campaign is sort of highlighting um, the issue that although the small scale fleet make up about 80% of the UK quota, they only currently have access to 4% um, of our actual of our fishing quota. So, um, so sorry, yeah, 80% of the fleet only has access to 4% of the quota. So what we're trying to do is get government to urgently redress this situation in line with the new European fishing laws that came into um, came into sort of functioning last last year. Um, at the moment it just means that local fishermen can't earn a decent living, um, they can't um, fish as much as they should be able to and massive, often foreign control fishing businesses um, are getting the lion's share of the quota. There's one Dutch vessel that currently has 21% um, of the British quota just for one boat. Um, so we're trying to put more of the quota back in the hands of local sustainable fishermen.